Tansett 2021 MBA question paper oda video solution question number 70 idu oru data sufficiency question menstruation oda chapter la nadandhu irukku interesting question what is the cost of laying the carpet in a rectangular hall right take a look at the statements in a while what are the answer options statement 1 alone is sufficient na a is the answer option 2 alone is sufficient answer option is b statements 1 and 2 together are sufficient answer option is c the date the question cannot be answered with the information in the statements it's insufficient abina the answer option is d what is the question what is the cost of laying the carpet in a rectangular hall you want to say that the cost of laying the carpet is rupees 4000 right abina edho or number kudukka porom if the answer to the question is a number then when is the data sufficient the data is sufficient when we have a unique value take a look at statement 1 alone and see what it tells us the cost of the carpet is 450 rupees per square meter. Wonderful. In the rectangular hall, or the area is right? This is per square meter. We have to the area wise. In the rectangular hall, or the area, we do information. So, therefore, without knowing the area, the area is 10 square meter, the cost would have been 4500 rupees. If it is 100 square meter, the cost would have been 45,000 rupees. So, we have to know the area. Statement 1 alone is not sufficient. It is giving some useful information but not all that is required. So, in eliminate answer option A, the answers are going to be one of the other three, B, C or D. Take a look at statement 2 alone. Perimeter of the hall is 50 meters, right. The direct eliminate panel, perimeter thirinj irukhi, okay, rectangle thirinj perimeter thirinj irukhi, adhilan the area kandu pidikin pidikin questionable, we will look at it. Definitely cost illa, adhilan statement 2 alone is not sufficient, right. Cost thirinj irukhi, we will not be able to find the answer. Best case, that is not the case. The perimeter is not the case. This rectangle perimeter is not the case. The area is not the case. The wipe. But we do not have the cost. So, statement 2 alone is also not sufficient. Rule out this answer option. Let us combine the statements and see whether it makes sense. The approach I am going to take is a counter example. Cost is good. All that I need to figure out is can I get the area using the perimeter. It is a rectangle. I am using a counter example. Now, the rectangle order, perimeter is 50. Length plus length plus width plus width, this is equal to 50. Let us say this is a 20 length, 5 width. So, this is obviously having a perimeter now which is 50. 2 times the length plus 2 times the width, right. Now, the area is equal to 100. In that case, cost is equal to 45,000. This is one example. Perimeter 50, ke area 100 is let us look at another example and see whether it makes sense. Right. So, we have a perimeter of 50. So, I can go with a 15 and a 10, 15 and a 10. So, 2 times length 30, 2 times width 20 makes it 50. If the area is equal to 150, the cost will essentially be 450 into 100 plus 450 into 50, which is 67,500. In the earlier example, the cost of 45,000. In the example, the cost of 67,500. Rindale may cost per unit square meter is 450. Is the perimeter of both the rectangles 50? Yes, either perimeter is equal to 50. In the case, may perimeter is equal to 50. With perimeter, we will not be able to determine the area. We can have multiple rectangles that are possible. We will have infinite values for the cost of the carpet. So, we will not be able to find a unique answer. After what? After combining the two statements. So, combining the two statements is also not going to give us a unique answer. The given data is not sufficient. Choice D is the answer to this question. If it had given us the area of the rectangle, the dimensions of the rectangle, length of the width of the rectangle, perimeter and the perimeter we can have multiple rectangles having the same perimeter. So, the given data is not sufficient.